y'all doing fantastic. Here's a little advice that might help you out, help some people out. Maybe, maybe not, I'll just put the information out there. Whatever you do with it is up to you. When you're talking to a freight broker or a freight broker, a freight broker's agent, some of them are savvy, some of them are not. The savvy ones will reverse engineer what you're saying. For example, I hear it on YouTube. Uh, I will only run, I won't run for less than two dollars a mile. And these people will tell the freight broker that. So the savvy freight broker was saying, okay, well, he's happy with two dollars a mile. So when something comes up that pays above two dollars a mile, that I can pay above two dollars a mile, I already got a truck, a potential truck that will pull this load for two dollars a mile. You get what I'm saying? I posted that load, uh, not the load. I made a post on YouTube. You know the post feature. And I put a screenshot up of the DAT Solutions low board of Midwest Reefer Freight that comes with, that's coming to the East Coast that we're picking up on Friday, which is today, 11-16. Some of those freight rates were between three and four dollars a mile. Might have been like a, a little bit over four dollars a mile. I didn't really study the, the mileage and the, the rates and stuff like that. I was just looking at the big numbers. So when you, so let's say there's a load going from point A to point B. doesn't matter where it's going. And the broker is able to pay to pay the truck let's say $3 a mile. But you already told him, uh, $2 a mile. I need at least $2 a mile. Well, uh, when you say at least, that means, okay, well, all we got, in, all we can pay is $2 a mile. I can't really come up above that. And we can maybe give you 205 or something like that. See, it's the same concept of when you go to a car dealer and you're looking at the car, truck, whatever, and the salesman asks you, hey, uh, $200, that's it. I can't go above $200. That is it. Okay, $200. Well, okay. The purchase price is, I don't know, $20,000 or whatever. Let's stretch that bad boy out for 10 years. 10, 11 years. But he only he's comfortable making $200 a month payment. Give it to him. Give the people what they want. It's the same concept. So, when you're talking to, with people, talking to freight brokers and stuff like that just be mindful of what you're saying because a lot of them will play dumb and they're trying to figure 